Hello and welcome back to Film It Friday. If you're new here, my name's Chris. I'm a videographer, photographer, and YouTuber. I make videos every single week about video and photography related reviews, tips, and tricks. So if you like that kind of thing, why not hit subscribe? Today, I haven't really got time to make an episode of Film It Friday. It's Tuesday at the moment. Film It Friday comes out on a Friday. Um, but at the moment, I'm currently moving this massive shed. This is going to be the new Film It Friday and Thrive headquarters, um, and it's currently in the wrong garden. This is going to be my home office, it's fully insulated, and we're going to be moving into here in about a month. So this week's episode, I'm just going to show you us taking it down and moving it to my house. We're not going to put it back up for another month or so. And then in a couple of months time, I'm going to show you the finished product. Um, it's hopefully going to be really nice. So just to give you an idea of how big it is, um, this is the far side of it. It's 5.7 meters long by 4.2 meters wide. And it did have a carpet in it. We've had a slight leak where the toilet is. Toilet's coming out. Um, there was a wall that runs along here and up here. We've taken that down. So hopefully this size is going to be nice and big for us. It's about three times the size of my current office, so it should be really nice. What we're planning to do is have desks all the way along here so myself, Anya and Cam can have a workstation. We're going to have a tool section workshop kind of area here with an overhead setup here. I'm going to have my Film It Friday desk in front of the window so I can use natural light to film with the desks behind me. And we're going to have some backdrops here so we can do headshots and talking heads in a really nice space. We've got quite high ceilings as well. This is three meters high with a nice skylight to let in light. Let's just take you outside. It does need a lick of paint. It's been here for 20 years. But it should be a really nice structure once we're finished. So me, Rachel and my dad started taking everything down uh, last Saturday. So we have currently taken off all the skirting boards around the top and the bottom, all the electrics around. Um, we've had to number every single one of these panels. It's going to be quite a task to bring this down. opportunity so quick update this is day two and we've got most of the roof off, all the insulation out. Roof's going to be off probably an hour's time. And then we're going to start taking the walls down. And we've just ordered the flatbed to come pick it up tomorrow. Fun times. Dreams do come true. The man shed. If we leave that here, take it off. Well, that's not going to leave, is it? It's not going to leave. So we're nearing the end of the first day with our handymen here taking it down. And this is what their drive looks like. All full of the shed. And we're just taking the floor up now. We were expecting this to take two days and then a day for moving it, but it looks like we're gonna be down today. It's about four o'clock. Got an hour to do the floor. Looks good.
It's moving day. So I don't ruin it. I mean, so because it can be ruined. I was going to wear mine and I thought, no, I won't, just in case I get filmed. CW Media doesn't exist anymore, so this t shirt doesn't really matter. So the t shirt doesn't exist either. <laughs> <laughs> So this is the roof and a little bit more wall and that's all the trim that goes around the outside. One more load after this and it should be moved. And even the tree survived. So that's it, one shed successfully moved and stacked. Um, we're gonna cover this up with tarpaulin really tight so the rain doesn't get in, and then we're gonna start rebuilding it. Um, I'm just gonna show you where it's going. So eventually it's gonna be in here, in that kind of footprint around there. And I assume there's gonna be some questions about how much this has actually cost me. So I'm just gonna go through that now. So the two guys that we had for two days cost us 570 pounds, including moving it. Um, including the van, including all the insurance and petrol and things like that. So that's how much it's cost us. And the actual shed itself, we got for free. So we did have to take it all apart piece by piece, but it's only cost us 570 pounds. And like I said at the beginning, it's nearly six meters by four and a bit meters. So it's gonna be a really nice space. They basically wanted it gone out of their garden so that they could create an annex for their elderly parents. Um, and they needed it gone quickly. So we made a deal. We got rid of it in the time frame and we didn't have to pay anything for it. I really hope you enjoyed this episode of Film It Friday. I will be making another episode when we started erecting it and putting it up so you'll see all of it going back up and you'll see how cool it's eventually going to look. If you like this video, please subscribe so you never miss another episode. Thanks for watching and see you again next week.